stop prompting ChatGPT 5 like it's 2023. GPT 5 has changed and your old prompt strategies don't work. Here are three smarter ways to prompt to get what you want. But first, save and follow. One, be ultra specific, not vague at all. GPT 5 doesn't fill in the blank like GPT 4 used to. If you're vague, it plays it safe. The output feels robotic and generic. So instead of write a blog post about burnout, say write a 500 blog post for a startup founders who are secretly burning out. Make the tone casual and honest. Don't give generic advice. Focus on three real behaviors they should stop doing. Two, break big tasks into micro prompts. GPT-5 handles layered work better when you guide it step by step. If you dump a wall of instruction into one box, it gets confused and goes generic. Instead of write a full LinkedIn post, caption, hook, CTA, and three content variation, start with give me three hook ideas for a LinkedIn post about burnout recovery. Then take hook number two, for example, and write a short post that sounds like I'm venting, but with a clear takeaway. Then say, now add a relatable CTA that invites people to share their own story. Three, treat it like a creative partner, not a vending machine. GPT-5 isn't about one and done prompt anymore. It's better at conversations than commands. Instead of write a caption for this product, say, I'm launching a planner for ADHD founders. The vibe is calm, focus, no fake hype. Help me brainstorm caption angles that don't sound like sales copy then okay i like number three now rewrite it with a question make it punchier conversation baby follow if you want smarter chat gpt tips that actually save time